Grim sales. Zoinks! Zoinks, holy cow. Yes, hi! Late night stream. I did promise you guys a stream today, and, well, I'm upholding that promise. Um, unfortunately, I did have to delay it until now. Um, one, because I didn't want to interfere with Montezuma Tuesday, which is always a wonderful time, and everybody should watch that when they have the time. But also, I needed to take care of some personal things. So that means we have Late Night Vibes on the Q&S today. Some Late Night Vibes. Some simple operations. <laughs> Plot twist is just a river content. Well, we will be running a lot of logs. So this may just be a good old logging time, quite frankly. So, we, we do need to run some logs. Luckily, I think that's all we need to really run. Um, I should probably, at some point, run, run the, the uh, passenger trains around each other. But at the moment, we're going to be running some logs. So that's the game plan. We're going to try for that. JSJ Inks here. Welcome, JSJ Inc. Gun Roads. How oh, things for you? Finally get to catch another stream. Moving such a royal donkey. Moving can suck, and I'm sorry that you're going through that. I do hope it gets better uh, once you're settled. I do appreciate you catching the stream. So welcome, welcome, welcome. Um, as for things going with me, things are going well. It's a nice little late night stream, late night vibes. Uh, even though I didn't get the stream earlier in the day. We do need to deal with some logging. Which actually may take us into late night, late night vibes in the game. Who knows? Kirchung. Grimsdale, thank you. Thank you for the $2, Grimsdale. And change railroad name, Dale Supply and Machine Railroad. Is that a, um... Oh, shoot. What's the name of the show? Is that a Hank Hill reference? Forget the name of the show. But it's... Oh, King of the Hill. Is that a King of the Hill reference? Propane and propane accessories. The other thing is the Streamlabs working. Because I have, I'm going to be spending tomorrow kind of building that out in, in Streamlabs itself. Tim's 383, hello. Oh, it's the planned name for your IRL gunsmith shop. Excellent. That's a nice name. That's fair. <laughs> that's a that's an important distinction, I would think. <laughs> I 
The RP's here. Hello. I keep seeing all these people are here, but then then uh, YouTube is just like, oh, you only have one concurrent viewer, zero concurrent viewers. I, I'm a little concerned. Is YouTube okay? <laughs> oh, Gustav 2.0. Yeah, I think that's a pipe dream there. Let's not let's not fund that. That just sounds like a bad idea. Potentially. The weirdest thing you've seen so far was in Railroad or when I ride a caboose on my passenger train. They did weird hopping. Like it doesn't multiplayer. Were you I'm guessing this means you're playing single player now, too? Potato goose stuff then. There we go, that's a better one. It's been a while since I've been up the Connolly Creek branch on stream. Johnny Coleman. Did I forget one thing? Like Kenosha music. I hope I didn't forget anything. I could be forgetting something. I don't know. So is this a chaos night or chill night? I could go for either. Um, it's late night vibes. Whatever in the, that ends up being is what that ends up being. Um, right now it's... I see you guys chatting and I really appreciate it, but it's like, apparently... YouTube thinks nobody's watching. This is weird. Oh, Big Bad John, thank you for gifting membership. Okay, so that part of Streamlabs worked. I appreciate that, Big Bad John. since we've been up to Colony Creek. I don't think I've really been up here since um, buying the third set of log cars, so we'll be able to see those today. <laughs> yes, the Scotch are drinking each other side the fate of chaos. You don't hear any music playing. I assure you the music is playing. It was playing. I don't know what happened to that. There. I think I, I think I exited out instead of minimizing it. My apologies. It's a late night stream. Anything could happen. Thank you again, big picture. And to Grimston for your for your kind donations. It's greatly appreciated. Also, for those who haven't seen it in a while, uh, we are only only ninety one thousand dollars in debt. I, the heck is that? Is YouTube having a stroke? Cause you're here, Nazu. Maybe that's why. 
Oh, are these the... Oh, these are the L3 cars. Okay. Whoops. It is Tuesday, so servers are updating. Luckily, I thought that was just Steam servers, but, you know. Beggars can't be choosers. <laughs> exactly, John Rhodes. Yeah, I'm not sure that you. I don't know if YouTube's having a, a timer or what, but it's saying a lot of people are. It's not recognizing that a lot of people are watching. My average view duration is very down for the amount of people that have been watching, so I don't know. If you, if you are here watching, you know, please tell me in the comments, because I don't know that YouTube is being reliable this evening, unfortunately. Uh, potentially Nazu. Uh, Steam servers update on Tuesdays, I know that much. Big Bad John's here. Limes to you too. Set MDAI to the interchange at Whittier. Come back to the train in Dillsboro. Uh, yeah. Grimsdale. Even though you don't own that trackage, the track still exists, so you can go all the way down. You need it to put a uh, fusee down. Yeah, this is weird. Oh well, we'll keep on going. We'll just keep on keeping on. Because that's all we can do. I see you guys chatting. So, uh, keep chatting, I guess. <laughs> yeah, we're, we're just swapping out logs. we should do this potentially properly because as fun as dutch dropping these cars and or fly switching these cars in it's generally only gone well a few times for me so we're gonna make sure that we do this right and now stream video is shorter after a weird refresh what do you mean by that, Nazu? sure what YouTube is up to. This is this is kind of weird. YouTube do, did a weird UI update. Oh. That could cause some things. And we'll do VR.
tech problem. Okay, yeah. Seems to be a YouTube problem. I wish I could do something about it, but it's YouTube's problem. No bidding on choo-choos on this river. <laughs> we can help. We can help. Please no. We only have the 12 in Whittier. I need to get a second engine in Whittier. I can't I can't really bend this engine preferably I mean unless somebody donates like 50 to 100 dollars then maybe I'll consider it but also don't like don't feel under any obligation to do that in the small train I'll hail the big train the big all the big trains are put away I'm not gonna lie the big trains are away now all we have are the small trains. Now, if we get into night ops, then we might end up with some with um some big trains, because then we'll get into tomorrow. Ker chunk. Oh, nice, Jonathan Coleman. Good to hear. I'm just not going to be able to make it. No, that's... <laughs> exactly, Crimson. And Jonathan Rhodes, like, I completely understand that. Please feel, don't feel any actual obligation to donate. Please take care of yourselves first. Don't go bankrupt. Please. Please don't bankrupt yourselves. Four, four, four. Urban Rally Racer, I'll bring out the big train. I'll hail the big train. Never going to get time bonus being sick. That's true. You've liked the th stream three times and it keeps resetting. I think YouTube was doing something weird. Because it, it keeps saying I have no viewers, but you guys are obviously here, so. Oh, very nice, John Lincoln. Cool. Those can load up with logs now. Luckily, we don't have to worry about time bonuses. You need Chuck Norris to kick cars. Off. No, Chuck Norris is not on this railroad. Chuck Norris is on the Supper and Southern, which we are not on this evening. But we may be on, on Thursday.
do 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 <laughs> we're going off the rails in the crazy train um if youtube keeps acting up we might be After you pay down the day, you could name it name. You could get a train and name it Chuck Norris or name it Heist. Um, right now I got all the trains I kind of want, assuming I don't overshoot. See, this is what happens when I start paying attention to the chat. I overshoot my my stop. Hope that goes well, Jonathan Coleman. I seem to have lost a car or two. I, I did some switching. Resource has been exhausted, check, check quota. Yeah, YouTube broke something. Yay, YouTube. Yeah, no, Urban Rally Racer, that's, that's a YouTube problem, unfortunately. But we shall persevere. The logs must go to East Whittier. It's like the milk must go to New York. The logs must go to East Whittier. Good day, tell you. Welcome. But there are two engines. When they double track at Connolly Creek, they didn't. Um, there's a passing siding up at the top near L3. Good day, tell you. Uh, playlists aren't showing up either. That's weird. <laughs> oh, jeez. So the tank Mikado might be worth it now, I'm not gonna lie. Um, th I will say the the um, fixing of the water consumption probably has helped it. Um, I don't personally own one though. And apparently we took those turns a little too spicy, so hope it's gonna get fixed after this. Yeah. There's a passing siding up at L2, so. Or not L2, L3.
Lots of spicy sounds. Lots of spicy sounds. We don't like spicy sounds here. <laughs> Maybe next class should be earth sauce, not scotch. <laughs> Maybe. Just grease the tray. Chris, here. That's how it works, right? Um, that's how it can work. It doesn't prevent the spicy sounds. It just eases the spicy sounds. Um, you also want to grease the insides of the rails, not the tops, because then you just cause slipping issues for the engine. Um, so, like... Also, don't grease rails unless you're expressly told to do so and are a member of railroad staff. Because that would just be bad. Spicy home food is good. Not so much coming from us. Yes, exactly. Exactly. Okay, good. Good to know, Chris Aaron. The logs must go to the sawmill. What happens when you put super hot sauce in a firebox? It wants water and milk. I don't think the firebox is going to care so much. Because last I checked, fireboxes don't have taste buds. The engines might. And who knows, maybe the engines like hot sauce. More hot sauce, more steam. Maybe. That would definitely be uh, an interesting effect. Fairy wool. Uh, Fairy wolf, we are having issues. Um, I can guarantee you there's roughly probably at least 20 people watching, yet YouTube says there's no people watching, and people try to keep liking the stream. And... Um, don't, don't have it. Don't have things like that. One second, folks.
Sorry about that, guys. Had to take a call real quick. Um, we'll have to go get something outside in a few moments, but um, as you can tell, we are wrapping up the day here. YouTube finally starting to come around. Oh, yep, there, there we go. It's coming around on my end, too. I see five people watching and three likes. <laughs> so may maybe YouTube's finally done having a stroke. Um, so to answer Fairy Wolf's question, yes, YouTube is having issues. Um, but they are slowly resolving, hopefully. Appalachian Chaos is here, welcome. Alrighty, folks, I will be back momentarily. I need to run outside and get something real quick. Uh, so bear with me for one moment, please. Sorry about that, folks. How many shots has crew changed? Don't worry. Crew changes no shots. <laughs> I don't drink, exactly. I do drink soda. So, it's a good sip of whatever soda beverage you desire.
But I do apologize for that extended break. Um, very kindly, a member of family was dropping something off for me. So, I will be parking the choo-choo. And we're going to go to sleep. And then once we go to sleep, um, I'm going to run down and go get some of that thing. And then we'll continue on with the next day. Alrighty. So settings, sleep. Alrighty, so we are back. Let's check out the financials. Okay. Well, we can pay down the debt by three grand. So we're under 90,000 in debt, that's good. The interchange received 47 cars, which is less than expected. So, let's get to Silva. And run the engines are Well, it looks like YouTube has recovered, thankfully.
We need a one chip challenge level spicy dunk. Maybe, maybe we do. All right, that's run around. Apparently, those cars weren't tied in at all. Oops. Yeah, you might need a refresh. Potentially. But things seem to, to be happening. and then some. Oh god. I mean, I prefer not to, but I, I, I'm not above crashing stuff for money, so. Don't take that as a you must, but if you desire and are able, I am not above crashing for money. <laughs> I, uh, <laughs> I understand John Rhodes. Keep the wife happy. Those are up and running. I guess let's go to Ella. Or not Ella. Silva. Let's see what we're see what we're dealing with. Decently long string of Robinson Gap.
1985. Welcome. I don't think I've seen you in chat before. It's been a while. What's up? Not much. We're just riding trains. We're just running trains and figuring out what we're doing. So I think the first order of business is to grab a choo-choo. We gotta bring this mess back to Dillsboro. Excellent ice, nineteen eighty five. I approve of this, and I hope your travels go well. Definitely have to get coal and water. That's good, Ice Nineteen Eighty Five. Glad to hear it. Really glad to hear it. Excellent job. Uh, seltzer aid, I guess, is like power aid, but seltzer. Or, or more likely, it's lemonade, but seltzer. not having a rest. Train having a refill.
We need coal and water before we go grab the interchange stuff. Ah, so it is seltzer combined with lemonade. Seltzer. -y. Makes sense. So I guess since this is morning, this is um the train having breakfast. <laughs> potentially tolerate, potentially. Rain need earth sauce. Uh, not really, Tare. Um, soda, ha it has, like, syrup and flavoring in it. Seltzer, not so much. Speaking of soda, hashtag not sponsored, but definitely having a nice, nice can of the Beepus right now. like the Beepus here. Now, if Beepus wishes to sponsor... Thoughts on the new sodas released this week? I have, um... I have no idea what you're referring to. <laughs> referring to, Nazu. Um... So if you could enlighten me, that would be awesome. Um, but I have zero clue as to what new sodas were released this week. I don't... I unfortunately do not keep up with that news. Oh good, number one's fixed. Is the caboose fixed? Caboose is fixed. Good. Coke Zero barbecue sauce flavor. Yeah. That just sounds disgusting. If I want something that tastes like barbecue sauce, I'm getting barbecue sauce. I'm not getting Coke Zero. Baja and Lime. Peach Pepsi, Sprite Chilled, and Coconut Dr. Pepper. Not real. Okay, good. Um, of those, Nazu... The ones I would be interested in is Peach, Pepsi, and Sprite Chilled. The other ones, are, they don't sound appetizing to me, personally. But that's just me. Isn't Sprite always chilled? Um, that is a great question, Tare. That is a great question. I have no idea. Chill is cherry lime. It sounds like it might be okay. If that's what it is. I'd have to try it. That and peach Pepsi. Those, those are the two I would be at least willing to try. The other ones, I'm not a fan. I'm not a fan of Dr. Pepper to begin with, let alone coconut. 
Um, and I'm not a fan of Mountain Dew. Mountain Dew just does not appeal to me. <laughs> exactly, Talia. Exactly, Talia. Sprite is always good. Coke, or no, not Coke. Uh, McDonald's Sprite. I don't know what they do to it. Because it always, it, it tastes so different than normal Sprite. And I don't know what they do. It's just <laughs> insanity. Railroad, 97 overall. We're slowly getting our safety rating back up. Yeah, same. Same on that front there, too. <laughs> exactly. Uh, John Rose, I'm I, I I drink both. I my policy on soda is so long as it's dark and carbonated and doesn't say diet. And usually just says like cola or something. I will usually buy it depending on which one's on sale. Like some weeks, uh, the local Dollar General has Pepsi on sale. Other weeks it has Coke on sale for a better price. So just for me, it honestly depends. see cola any day. Understandable. I've heard good things about that. Dollar General is also weird. It is, but hey, they're everywhere. Version Coke from the 90s is pretty good. I don't recall ever trying that. I was a little too young to maybe try that. Also, I should really make sure the switch is thrown the way I want it to be. Otherwise, this is not going to go well. We don't. We don't want a cur dunk. CNC contract with Pepsi, they don't sell Coca Cola product. Oh! Uh, our Dollar Generals sell both, so that might just be a, ca a Canada thing. Yeah, that is odd. Totally don't work there. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I genuinely feel bad for the, for, the one, for the people who work at the Dollar General by me, purely because they. 
usually only schedule one person during the day sometimes. And maybe that's because that's all they can get. And when they do that, um, that one person has to do cashing out or be a cash register, um, do stocking and inventory. And it's just too much for one person to do when you're trying to do the whole store. Um, they might have tell you. They, entirely possible they could have. Um, I would just think that if it's a if it if it is a subsidiary of Dollar General, I don't know that they could have necessarily done that. But maybe they did. Yeah, Tower. Yeah. Um, there are some mornings and even some evenings where it's just one person, and I feel so bad for them at times. There there are times where I'll use the self checkout. Not because I necessarily want to, because I don't like using self-checkouts, but purely so I don't put more stress on the staff who is there. And I just I just genuinely feel sorry for them at times. It's like I I you're in a cruddy situation and I'm sorry. Oh, okay. That makes sense. So it's basically, it's, it's the Canadian version of, but not owned by. Got it. Got it. I, I understand now. That makes sense. I'm glad that switch was thrown that way. I'm very glad that switch was thrown that way. Alright, how do we want to assemble this train? Who, who was in charge of assembling this train? Holy cow. So shop floor person in years past, but there's always been at least a manager around either doing something else on the floor or able to step, step in fast and help with the budget is pushed. Yeah, it, it's... Yeah, exactly. Even with two people, it's almost not enough, but... I, I It's just one of those things, like, I genuinely feel sorry for them at times because you, you don't... You know that they didn't sign up for that. You know for a fact they didn't sign up for that. And... No one should have to deal with that. Okay, who some like... This is kind of nonsensical. Stenzel, Whittier, Appalachian Hardwoods. Okay. I think I know how I want to deal with this. But we'll work it out as we go, I guess. Okay, so what's on the end of this train? Let's figure that out. So the Alarka stuff's there. And that's old Dillsboro. And Whittier Sawmill. I, so it's looking like it's all Larka and Ella. I want to take it. So it's looking like I want to take these cars, stick them on this train, pull forward, and then go on this train. Okay. That's not ideal, but we'll deal with it. I have it to uh, fully blocked, uh, I tell ya.
Yeah. Jeff Jeff off the southern was not kind to us. Like this this blocking does not make sense. And I have it set to fully blocked, so make that make sense, I guess. One thing I wish is, I wish we had a third track here. Yeah, that's, you're unfortunately probably right, Tom, right? Exactly, big trains here. Pull everything. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna have to. That's definitely what I'm gonna have to do. I just wanted to get it some of it pre-sorted, so I can do some more stuff at Dillsboro or have greater flexibility. But yes, the big train is in fact here. I'll hail the big train. God, if I had big drainage, maybe. Now, see, that makes sense. The problem is, what happens when you are literally the only person? And I guess they try to schedule it, like, even if there is only one person, it's during, like, a non-peak time. But the issue with that becomes, how do you, what happens when that non-peak time, surprisingly, or unsurprisingly, becomes a very peak time? All hail the big train. Exactly. The big train is here. All hail the big train. So this is going to be at least four. We know this train is going to be 47 cars. This is not the biggest train I have run in this game. That belongs, that honor belongs to the big train on Angry Save. Oh, I can imagine, Nazu. I can imagine. I can imagine when the truck comes in, that just makes it a pain. Yeah, the, those two stub tra those two stub tracks though, you have to cheese in a little bit. Um, there's no actual milestone for them, at least not present in game. So it's one of those things like they are there, but you have to cheese them in. But the actual like three, three tracks in Dillsboro that 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 helps for sure. That's gonna. That's honestly going to help sort out this mess. Meanwhile, let's take a peek and keep an eye on the passenger train. Conquering the end of Larka. Okay. Keep an eye on them, see what we'll meet. Fly switching passenger and log spin my freak follow down to fifty percent. Whoops, Grimsdale. <laughs> yeah, when that happens, you you might want to just call it quits and go to bed for the night. Or clock out for the night. Uh yeah, there there's those passenger trains are running. And 
They they have people in them. Oh yeah, that that's a severe irk of mine too, Taya. I will never I will never yell at a store for being slow. Like I get it. Things things happen. Like I'll I'll even I'm one of those people who I believe in tipping even if the service is bad cuz you never know what people are going through and it's like that might be their only job. <laughs> exactly, Tari. No, that makes sense. Oh, those? Yeah. <laughs> that, is, that is definitely a question. Uh, understandable, Grimstale. Alright, we're shoving back 1,100 tons here. We're getting money from passenger trains. It's not a lot of money, but it's a steady small amount, which is nice. Scrim sale. Very nice. Making progress on your rare for the year. Chunk. Eighteen hundred tons. Here we go. Exactly, Tari. Not, it's not good for anybody involved in that situation, and I'm not a fan of making that situation worse. Like, I understand that people are in a rush, and they need to, like, get somewhere, but also understand that the store is also understaffed, and be cognizant of that. Like, there's no reason to be, there's no reason to be a dick about anything, really. In my mind. Oh yes, uh, ice. They did. Um, the F seven A's and B's are released. Green Ninja released those earlier this week, I think, yesterday. <laughs> John Rhodes, you're not wrong, unfortunately. That is they are, they are everywhere and I mean not with not without good reason. But they are in fact everywhere. All right, it looks like we're going to have to set up a meet in Ella. So we're just going to take care of that right now by flicking that switch. Excellent ice. I, I think you'll find them pretty nice. They're, they're good. I know Green Ninja is making constant improvements to those too. Um, so if you find any issues, send him um, a comment on Nexus Mods or something and he'll, he'll get right on that. He's pretty good about that stuff.
But folks, the big train is here. All hail the big train. It's not the biggest train, but it is a big train. <laughs> exactly. Uh, you, you're not wrong, John Rhodes. They do. Dollar General is convenient. Like, for me to get to a Walmart, it's a half hour. For me to get to a Dollar General, it's two minutes. For me to get to a grocery store is about seven minutes. So it's one of those things, like, if I just need, like, soda or chips or something, Dollar General's right there. Why not? Have a good night, guys. Enjoy. Hopefully your 3 a.m. wake up card goes well. Yeah, Nazi, you're right. It's not. It's maybe it came from a possibly. Who knows? It'd be funny if it did. So the one thing about, um, oh, the map on the gives map coloring, that, that's a helpful one. That is genuinely a helpful one. Um, I will say any physical map mobs I wouldn't recommend, because chances are any map updates will break them. The colors, um, dictate destination and mainline, and things like that. So, like, here you can see all the colors of all the destinations, whether you're on the main or not, things like that. It's actually really handy. And it shows you where the cars are, too. Where the standard map doesn't. DJ's older. Hey, it might be. It explains how it can be successful. Like, you've been around a while, you can be successful. Exactly, good for planning. Alright, we're going to pull in here and get some of this switched out. And then we're probably going to call it a night, actually, given we don't want to go too late. It's almost 11 o'clock here. So, yeah. I do want to I do want to say I appreciate everyone watching. Like, thank you for thank you for watching this late. I genuinely appreciate it, and I appreciate any support you guys give me. Whether you like, you comment, you subscribe, whether you donate, it it all means a lot. It all helps. 
and I genuinely, genuinely appreciate it. And it's always humbling to just see how much support and love you guys give me and show me. And I, I can only hope to show my gratitude as much as I can and genuinely, gen genuinely appreciate it, guys. Genuinely. Light speed of an unlaid swallow is 24 miles per gallon. Thank you, Meme. 24 miles per hour. <laughs> Tari got the joke. Again, genuinely appreciate it, guys. Thank you so much. Miles per use. The sleep is calling. It very well might be. All right. Oh, good. We're we're gonna be able to fit this all on two tracks. That was a terrible Kenosha rewind. Try again. <laughs> oh, God. See, we're trying to not Kenosha. So when Kenosha plays, chances are we're going to not Kenosha. And Daryl Dean, you're more than welcome. I appreciate you guys being here. And just... It's always nice to it's generally humbling and just it, it it generally makes my week a little bit better seeing you guys support me and that in the way you just, that you're able to and on some weeks where it's harder than others it, it definitely helps and you guys are awesome and I just I can't say that enough See, John Rhodes, unfortunately, it's in the playlist. I don't control if it plays or not. I would have to take it out of the playlist in order for that level of control to happen. on these cars. Let's see where trains are. Yeah, it looks like an Ella. An Ella meat's going to be good. It would help if I would flick the switch in the right direction. <laughs> Classification yard on a 90 degree curve. Hey, it works. You actually kind of get more yard tracks. Um, that way. It's, in that, it's a nice little space... Space way of doing it. Because terrain rise, this is probably the only place you could do it. Now, you could probably extend it further. 
I'm not gonna lie. There, bud. Terrible for visibility and give a hand signal. You're not wrong. You're not wrong. See, you're not wrong there, and that's why the radio comes in handy whenever it was invented, which I know wasn't during the time period of this game, but still. They have them just backpack size. Yeah, I don't think backpack size really helps. FNG running around with the right here. Yep. Stick that on the new guy. All I want railroad devs slash mod devs. I want a thing of cards in the caboose or observation in a suit like Sir Top. <laughs> That's fair, Nazu. That's fair. We can always hope, right? Uh, they would have used multiple crews and they wouldn't have... They wouldn't have, have made such long moves, really. They would have had multiple people passing signals and everything. Also, arms are clearly cut from the same window. Oh, jeez. Yeah, it, like they would have had long trains, but basically once they got the long train made up, it would take the switch engine off, put the road engine on, and then you don't have to deal with the whole length. Nowadays you do have to deal with the whole length, but radios makes it easier. Um, but hearing stories of conductors walking a two mile train is not unheard of. We're just going to park the 20 right here for the next time. We're going to have some switching to do. We're going to have a coal drag to do. We're going to have a lot to do. And eventually, the old number one here needs to go back to Bryson. As do the two observation cars that currently left Bryson. Whoops. Uh, money situation though, we're doing pretty good. We have 88,000 in debt. We have 649 in the bank, soon to change a bunch. And we have $5,400 interest payment in 4 days, 17 hours. Uh, but on that note, guys, we're past 11 o'clock here. So I think I'm going to end the stream real quick. Thank you very much for watching this late night edition. Um, guaranteed a stream on Thursday. Uh, again, it might be a later one, depending. Uh, there may be one tomorrow if I can sneak one in at the end of the day, but we'll see what happens because I have a bunch of meetings tomorrow, so we'll see. But on that note, guys, I want to say take care. Thank you again for all your support, for your likes, your comments, your donations, your memberships. It, any way you guys support me is always genuinely appreciated, and I can't thank you enough. And on that, I just 
Again, thank you. I hope you have a great rest of your Tuesday evening or Wednesday morning, depending on where you are. And I shall see you all next time, which might be tomorrow or it might be Thursday.